All right, I figured we'd just have a very quick look at the economics of server destruction, uh, because I think that's uh, lost on quite a few people. Uh, because it's just so intensely uneconomical to try and give one of these away, sadly. Uh, so I, uh, prior to de deciding to scrap the server, uh, I had tried giving it away locally and nobody wanted it. Uh, shipping it, the base cost for shipping it pretty much anywhere is uh, about 200 euros and up. So we have to consider that and uh, we're, we're competing with what you're seeing on the screen and uh, these servers would be pretty much in the same price range if shipped to me. And it would certainly be cheaper shipping these to anybody else. I mean, uh, here you're looking at a similar server, except it's got a 45 nanometer processor, which is considerably faster. Uh, more, more RAM, everything's just better about this server. There's no reason anybody would buy my horrible old 65 nanometer server of this one. Uh, the same, uh, here is one which is pretty much exactly the same as the one I've got, except it's got more RAM uh, and no drive. Cat is $59 plus shipping. So that, that's roughly the value we're talking about. Now, some people told me to part it out, so let's do a quick calculation as to uh, what I stand to gain if we are to keep the process competitive. So, the processor, <laughs> four, uh, four euros, including shipping. Uh, RAM, uh, these are the same sticks I've got down to a part number, so I've got eight of those, so we're talking about, uh, what's that, one point uh, 1.18 euros times 8 uh, plus let's say 10 shipping for all of them so that's 19.44 plus our previous 4 so now we're up to a 24 dollar or 24 euro value in parts of a server and finally the working parts were used drives and uh, for those we're competing with uh, 19 dollars or about 18 euros so we'll add 17.81 euros to that and we arrive at a total value for the useful parts uh, in the server of 41 euros and 25 cents if we are to remain competitive with the other prices on the internet and uh, considering that I have to drive a long way to get to a post office and I have to pack and ship and manage everything that would just not be worth my while in the slightest so I'm hoping uh, that kind of goes to show why I decided to throw the server away. It was just going to get to tossed in the electronics dumpster, if not for my making a video about it and making a few bucks on the side. Uh, sadly, servers like this one have no real value. They are so plentiful that they're super cheap on eBay and uh, you can pretty much get them for free. So yeah, that's about it. Thank you for watching. Cheerio.